All right, and we're now joined by Greenville University Panthers head coach Tom Ackerman, Emily Stahl, and Anna Finch. First off, congratulations, guys, on a wonderful season. Hard-fought battle out there. We'll start with you, Coach. Yeah. What did you see from the beginning of the match? Yeah, for sure. We were just uh, super impressed with them, um, really big, really fast, and I thought when they were in system, we just didn't have the blocking to touch it. We were one-on-one -on -one at the pin uh, a lot of times, and so we had to stay aggressive. Once we got them out of system, we were able to transition and score, but very impressed with them, well-coached team, and just a ton of weapons, so really fun, and our team played gritty. We never roll over. We keep fighting, so just impressed with them. They did a great job. And on the offensive mm -hmm. side, you were you know well-known throughout the, the entirety of the game. Was this, was this kind of a normal setup going, you know, having this later game at 8 p.m., was the preparation going through the week different than usual because it's playoffs, or was it kind of just? Um, it was pretty similar. I mean, uh, Jordan Limpa, my setter, and I, we've worked really, really hard to try to um, get that slide down that we've been running, and so we just trusted what we've been doing, and we just kind of stuck with the plan, and, um, you know, worked it as much as it could tonight. You know, facing a tough team like that, I'm like, does have its disadvantages. You guys stuck with them though in the first couple sets. You know, even the first set battling back and forth with 12 plus tie scores. How does that build your confidence, you know, as the game goes on? We love playing hard teams. I mean, playing tough teams like this, it really like, what all the work that we've done this season, anytime we score a point, it just makes it all worth it. I mean, with a team like this, how can it not be? And as a senior leader on this team, back to you, Emily, what makes this squad special? The culture. I mean, we came in my freshman year and we had more freshmen than there were returners. And that was a huge cultural shift. But even at that, like the coaches love and support us constantly. And no matter what, they're always going to push us to be the best. And I'll serve it back to you, Anna. Yeah. As the fifth year senior, the senior leader on this team, you know, maybe not having a season last year, but being back here, NCAA tournament, what has this kind of last hurrah meant to you? Yeah, so um, back in the fall of 2019, we had just a uh, disappointing end to our season, uh, losing in the conference semifinals. And so we have this goal of getting back to the NCAA tournament, and um, we stuck with it. And kind of like Stahl said, of just the culture of this program is unmatched. Um, everyone genuinely cares about each other, genuinely helps each other, and it's just unlike anything else. And then I'll send it back for a final question. Coach, what do these two seniors mean to this team? Yeah, no, absolutely. These are uh, one and two, the backbone of our team over the last four and five years. So they don't just care about volleyball. Uh, they don't just care about themselves. They, they put others first. They're willing to do that. They've really been willing to make huge sacrifices serving as leaders. Leadership is not tough, uh, especially in our program. We put a lot of responsibility on our athletes to be super involved and to put others first. And they do that. Um, and, you know, it's just they're game changers. So going to greatly miss them, no doubt, for sure. Love them both very much. All right. Thank you all for your time. Congratulations yeah. on the Thank season. you. Thanks a lot.